Hi, you guys. This is Black and Blue. And I don't know about you, but I'm ready to get into today's unboxing and show and tell. <laughs> Let's go. This is Black and Blue. Go ahead. What's the crime? An attempt to watch and not subscribe? Yep, that's a crime. Friends don't let friends watch and not subscribe. So, <laughs> come on, let's get into the video. Yes, you guys! I was contacted by this company and I jumped on it so fast. This is gonna be an unboxing for a company called New Crafty Day. Ah, I'm so excited. Okay, <sighs> calm, kamate. Look, this is something, you guys don't know what it is yet, but this is something that I do in my spare time. I've completed a lot of them and I've never done one from this company. So I am dying to see. I want to see the quality. I want to see the colors. I want to see the overall everything. So let's, let's go ahead and get into it. Ah! <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm so excited about this. All right, there's three items in here. Let me just show them each to you guys. I'm gonna start with the smaller one because it looks like there's like three variations of different sizes for each of them. So let's start off with a small one. This is gonna be a diamond painting. Ah, I have a video on my channel already. And it's not with this company, but it is a diamond painting. So I'm not new to this. <laughs> oh my gosh look at this i'm going to explain what diamond painting is here i just want you guys to look at it because it's easier to explain when you when you can actually see it first of all do you guys see this photo this is oh so cute this is luna oh my god her little oh my gosh and this is artemis and this is their baby what is her name i want to say it starts with a d i can't remember darn maybe it'll come to me later but this is so cute. This is an image that is based off of Sailor Moon, and I love it. Now, diamond painting, what is it? Diamond painting is basically a painting, an artwork that you can complete and then put in a picture frame and hang on the wall. What you do is you peel this plastic back for however much you want to do at that time. And when, once you're done for, say you do it for an hour, 30 minutes, 10 minutes, and then you're done for the day, you just put this back up to protect the sticky layer that's under this. It is sticky so that the diamonds will stick to it. Now, let's open up the diamonds and what comes with it. So right here are gonna be your tools that they give you. The tools they give you are, we're, gonna, we're about to talk about all of this. So they give you a pair of tweezers. They're not like the super high quality tweezers. They're just tweezers that will get the job done. So that you put a stone down, you need to lift it up. You can use these tweezers to do that. And then this is gonna be your picker upper tool. This has an end where you can pick up three diamonds at one time. And this is the end you use. Let's see if you can get closer. This is the end that you would use right here if you were to do one at a time, which is what I like to do. I don't like doing multiples at a time, but you have a choice. They even gave you this option to do even more at one time. That's a lot. <laughs> and that's where the diamonds go. So you've got that, and then they give you wax. This wax, you wanna take the plastic off of both sides, and then you're gonna use this tool to stick into, and the wax will go inside of here, and that's what's gonna make this able to pick up each of the diamonds you know what I was so curious if their diamonds were squared or circle I think they have both but this one specifically is going to be squared if I had to if I had to choose between squared or circle being easier I would say circles easier and a little less like you can do it without even thinking for squared you do have to face it a certain direction you can't have like a corner on a straight edge so you do have to put a little more thought into it while you're doing this but these are going to be the diamonds i'm going to open up the other ones i'm not going to or i'm going to show you guys the other ones since this one is squared i'm not going to do this one first so i'm going to actually i'm going to look at all of them and just decide which one do i want to do first you guys these are so inexpensive diamond painting is that budget friendly hobby 
that I got into a long time ago. My sister, my twin sister actually got me into it. But it's so inexpensive. It's so much fun. It's so relaxing. And when you're done, you literally just created art. And it looks really pretty. It looks so beautiful and blingy. And I love blingy things. So, gosh, it doesn't look like they would be blingy because they look like they're matte. They're not blinging, blinging. But when you're done, it just gives off this bling that you're like, where did that come from? So, ah, I love this one. Thank you so much. Let's go on to the next one. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ah, don't look yet. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. If you guys if you guys have been here for a while, you already know the addiction with Sailor Moon is real. It's really real. So no one should be surprised that these are the ones that I got. Oh my gosh. Look at her. Sailor Moon, look at her. Every single painting you get will come with the same tools. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. And it's really cool. If this is rolling on you, I got you guys, I got I got tips and tricks for this. If you don't have parchment paper, I usually use um, little square parchment paper slips. I take this plastic off, lay them down on here, and I take one off at a time, work on it, put it back when I'm done working on it for the day. But doing that also gets out this, this curl you have going on. But what also does, we'll just be pulling this back. If you pull this plastic back not all the way just like to there and then you lay it back down for some reason that gets rid of your rolling you guys see that no more rolling like tips and tricks you're welcome okay you're welcome <laughs> i do that really messily but that's all you gotta do i'm gonna be putting my parchment paper on here anyways but I am going to show you guys a little demo. I'm going to get started. I'm going to show you how I store them. My little diamonds. These are the colors for this one. And oh, yes, this one's circle. See? Oh, my God, I love circle. I'm probably going to do this one first. These colors are gorgeous. Eee! Oh, my God. And it'll show you what the picture looks like right here. So you can really just see it right here. Yay! And it'll tell you right here on the side how many colors you have. This one has... 21 colors so whatever storage you're going to use you're going to want to make sure you have that many containers to put all the stones in this is what i like to use it's pretty inexpensive this comes from either walmart michael's i believe it's cheaper at walmart so if you want to go to my walmart and get them this is awesome how many is in here one two three four five six times four yeah that's a pretty good amount and we definitely have enough for our 21 I love this okay this one is gorgeous and it does come with the same tools this one has a smaller section for your wax but it's all the same really and this one also doesn't have the tweezers or anything but it's potentially because they sent me three of them and they knew I was gonna have this one so then they probably sent this because you know they don't need to keep on sending everything with oh this one with it but this is like two versions I love it. This one is so cute. This is a great contender. I love this. You guys see it's bigger than the other one. Okay. Next up, we have the third one. I honestly don't even remember what these are. I just remember the theme. I don't remember what they are. So I'm so excited. You guys, the link is going to be down in my bio or my description if you look down there it's going to have each link to each one of these separately if you like one of them and want it and it's also going to have a link just to their website there's also going to be a code there's a code down there okay check that out <laughs> but if you guys want to go see their prices they seriously when i was looking on their website they have like a trillion different designs for everyone there's a design for every single person in this world and there's so many. I didn't even go through all of them. I just was like, whoa. But there is a search button. So I typed in Sailor Moon and boom, boom, bam, bam. They start popping up and I'm like, okay, I need all of them. <laughs> but ah, oh, let's look at this one. Oh my gosh. Oh my, please be circle. Oh my gosh, I think it is. Look at this. This one's even bigger. And it's circle. Yes. I just really love circle more. <laughs> I love circle the most. They're all beautiful. They're all beautiful. So it's just, I love to be, I love to not have to think about anything. Just 
let my hands do all the movement and all that. You guys, everybody is in here. Jupiter is my favorite, Sailor Moon, Sailor Mars. I always get Neptune and I always get them mixed up. But uh, Venus, Rini, Sailor Mercury, Mercury, Sailor Mars. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to do this. I am so excited. Okay, this picture is beautiful. And it did come with the same as the last one, except this one has a longer uh, wax. So, you know what? You're going to get a surprise. You won't even know which one of these you're going to get when you get it. <laughs> but the most important thing you need, the most important thing you need is a tray for your stones. When you put them in, they have these ridges in them so that if your your stones are flipped on its back, you don't want to pick it up from the, that opposite end because you need to pick it up in order to put it down. So you just give this a little shake, put your stones inside, give it a little shake, and those little ridges help them flip over. So this is really necessary. You need your wax and you need your tool. That's literally all you need for this. It's so inexpensive, you guys. Most of them are under $10. Like a whole painting under $10. Like what? Where do they do that at? <laughs> Oh, new crafty day is where. Oh, I'm so excited. I don't I don't see why there would be any other site I would ever need to go to if I am looking for specifically diamond paintings. Now, this is not done. I was just working on this because I don't know. I'm just working. It is actually turning out prettier than I thought, but I'm gonna use this to write on top of my plastic containers. You could use stickers, and sometimes I do use stickers. However, I don't have those stickers right now, and you could just use alcohol on a paper towel and wipe it off later. So now I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna be talking for a little bit. I am gonna show you before I do start that little fast speeding of me putting these in their jars. I'm gonna show you what they look like so you can identify what goes where and am I opening the wrong one I am this is not the one I want to open we're gonna be doing this one these are packaged so nicely let me just grab this one for starters. And you guys see how much is in this bag. If you don't have containers like this, I'm actually loving that this company has theirs in Ziploc bags, every single one of their colors. That's crazy. Normally they come in those like plastic bags where you gotta cut the corner and pour them out, but this comes in a Ziploc bag and that makes it to where you don't necessarily have to pour them into a container like this. It's a little easier, but you don't have to. And actually now I'm thinking I don't want to. But I'll show you. This right here has a number seven on it. Wow, their packaging is their packaging is really good. So this has a number seven. And if you look on here, number seven, yep, that color is pretty close. So that is definitely that color. When you look on here, you'll see sevens. That's where you're gonna place those stones. Sevens. This is so pretty. Yeah, let me do a little demo for you guys. Let me see what colors I want to grab. Two and one. We're going to grab two and one. Here is one. And here is two. Since these are the colors I'm going to work on, I am going to go ahead and take out two jars and empty them. I'm going to put a little two and a one. So easy.
All right, you guys, is this not beautiful? Okay, I really didn't do much, but you guys see how you could just fit those colors in? And I'm sitting at the weirdest angle while looking at this, trying not to get my head in the camera shot, but this is so pretty. It's like so easy to do. What's really cool is kids can do this. This isn't just for an adult. It's not just for kids. It's for adults and kids. If you like repetitive things, which I really do, <laughs> and you like making art, you like being creative and just relaxing this is gonna be your best friend i love this so much a lot of my friends in my real life say i wish i had a hobby or i need a hobby and i'm like i have so many hobbies i can pass them on to you because i love this you guys saw me use the wax here and i just recovered it back up because it helps it to not dry out as quickly i love this you guys see how I just fold that plastic back when I'm done for, say I just did it and I'm done for the day. Just fold that plastic back up and keep it pushing. If you do have parchment paper, that's going to be your best friend. I don't know where mine is. Mine went running for the hills, I don't know. But just placing them on here and you don't have to worry about pulling this all back, pulling it all forward. You can have little squares and then just take a square off and work. Or take a square off, move it down a little bit so you only have a little bit exposed because it is sticky. But this is New Crafty Day. I am so excited about this website. I am ready for more. And I haven't even finished one. I already want more. The amount of designs they have is so amazing. They did send these to me and I can't thank them enough. I can't thank them enough. Thank you so much for sending this to me. Like, do I want to do an unboxing and review? Uh, yes, I do. <laughs> I hope you guys like this and if any of you guys are interested in getting this let me know in the comment section because i'm dying to see who would try diamond painting if you haven't already i know some people have and if you haven't let me know because this is super fun i want you i want to know if it looks fun to you guys or if it looks like nah <laughs> thank you guys i appreciate you for being here and i will catch you guys in the next one i'm 10 8 bye